Sharm El Sheikh International Airport Arabic Mtar Sharm Al Sheikh Aldli Matar Sharm El Sheikh El Dala IATA SSH ICAO Hesh is an international airport located in Sharm El Sheikh Egypt It is the third busiest airport in Egypt after Cairo International Airport and Hurghada International Airport Topic Overview The airport was opened on May 14, 1968 as an Israeli Air Force base. After the signing of the Egypt-Israel Peace Treaty in 1979 and subsequent Israeli withdrawal from the Sinai Peninsula, it was reopened as a civilian airport. The largest regular aircraft using the airport was a Transaero Airlines-operated Boeing 747-400. These flights transiting from Moscow ended when Transaero ceased operations in October 2015. British Airways operated the only regular scheduled Boeing 777-200ER service from Gatwick Airport. However, this service and others has ceased due to concerns over the downing of Metrojet Flight 9268 on 31 October 2015. In 2008, the Egyptian Airports Holding Company EAHC announced plans to build a third new terminal at the airport. In July 2009 the Egyptian Holding Company for Airports and Air Navigation EHCAAN signed a contract with Spanish construction designers Pointec for the third terminal. The terminal was planned to double the airport's capacity from 7.5 to 15 million passengers per year. The project's primary costs were estimated at $350 million. The design phase was due to be completed by early 2010. International contractors then were invited for an open tender to construct the terminal, which was scheduled to be completely constructed by 2015. However, as of September 2016 construction has not commenced yet. In November 2015, passenger numbers significantly decreased due to the downing of Metrojet Flight 9268 on 31 October 2015. This led to airlines cancelling flights from the airport and operating rescue flights for stranded passengers. Governments from Russia and European countries such as the United Kingdom banned airlines from operating to the airport, citing safety concerns that were highlighted following the crash. In January 2018, it was announced that Egyptair Express would open a base at the airport for its incoming fleet of Airbus A220s. This would increase the amount of destinations served by the airline at the airport with the possibility of operating to cities in Italy, Germany, Morocco and India non-stop. Terminals Topic. Terminal 1 On 23 May 2007, the airport's second terminal was inaugurated with a capacity for 5 million passengers per year. The two-level, 43,000-square-metre terminal features 40 check-in counters and is designed to cater to a large number of international and chartered flights. It has two domestic and six international gates, all of which exit to remote stands. The terminal comprises three building components, two circular-shaped halls fused together by a wedge-shaped intermediate space dubbed the boat. This serves as a passenger transit hub housing passport control, duty-free, and VIP areas as well as cafes, restaurants. The halls, in stark textural contrast to the solid mass of the boat, feature airy, billowing tent-like roofs inspired by the indigenous Bedouin culture. Topic. Terminal 2 Although known as Terminal 2, this is actually the airport's original terminal building. The building underwent a complete modernization program in 2004 and has a passenger handling capacity of 2.5 million passengers per year. Since the inauguration of Terminal 1 in 2007 most airlines have shifted operations to the new building. In December 2016 Egyptian Airports Company announced plans to extend Terminal 2. EAC plans to expand the terminal and increase its capacity by 2 million passengers per year, thus taking the total capacity of the airport to 9.5 million. This also includes the construction of a new runway and 40 new airsides. Topic. 
Airlines and destinations Accidents and incidents On January 3, 2004, Flash Airlines Flight 604, en route to Cairo and then Paris as its final destination, crashed in the Red Sea shortly after taking off from Sharm el Sheikh, killing all 148 people on board. Causes for the accident include pilot error and instrument failure, but investigators have been unable to reach a consensus. On August 23, 2015, Thomson Airways Flight 476, approaching Sharm El Sheikh at the end of a flight from London Stansted Airport with 189 passengers aboard, took evasive action to avoid a missile travelling toward it, the missile missed the airliner by about 1,000 feet 300 meters, and the plane landed safely. An investigation concluded that the missile was an Egyptian Armed Forces missile that had strayed from a military exercise. On October 31, 2015, Metrojet Flight 9268, en route from Sharm el Sheikh to St. Petersburg, Russia, crashed in the Sinai Peninsula between Nekel and Hausna, killing all 224 people on board, most of them Russian tourists. The jihadist group ISIL, at war with Russian forces in nearby Syria, quickly claimed responsibility for the crash, which was believed by Western governments to be the result of a terrorist bombing. Russian investigators confirmed in mid November that the flight was bombed. The investigation is still ongoing. Following these events, many countries ordered all flights to Sharm el Sheikh suspended until further notice. The security at Sharm el Sheikh is currently considered dangerously lax. Airport staff have been seen taking cash from passengers to let weapons and drugs through or to let passengers skip queues despite the bomb threat. See also List of airports in Egypt